I like the way badges work in 2K17, but I feel like there's something that can make them work a little bit better. Now, if you guys are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe. And if you aren't new, let me know some videos you guys would like me to do. I would definitely be looking at the comment. But anyways, I feel as if our players are too one-sided. So maybe this could help out the situation. Let's say you were a sharpshooter. You would only be able to get these badges Hall of Fame. All of you guys know what the process is. You get it bronze, then you upgrade it. But let's say I wanted to get posterizer. If I get 15 contact dunks, I could do that. But what if I wanted to get it silver, gold, or Hall of Fame? Now to get it bronze, that would only take 15. If I wanted to do it silver, I should be able to double that and do 30, then 60, then 120. And it should be like that for all of the badges. For those of you guys already opposed to it, think about it. How hard is it to get all of these badges on HOF? Just the ones that you already can get bronze, then put straight to gold, then go HOF. It's extremely hard, it takes a lot of time. Imagine having to do bronze, silver, gold, HOF. That would take forever. So for everybody that's gonna say it's cheese, if I spend that much time on the game, I should be allowed to do that. Now let's use another example. If I wanna get brick wall, that's 100 screens in one season. 100, 200, 400, 800, that's ridiculous. Nobody's gonna do that. Now the whole entire thing is, these badges are based off of your player. If you have a player that can easily get these badges, it's easier for you. If I have a 6'5 sharpshooter, it's gonna be really hard for me to keep on getting these bruiser animations. So obviously it's going to be really hard for me to get them in the first place. So if I get them, I should be allowed to do it. If it's cheese or not, I worked hard to be able to do that. I feel like 2K should stop catering towards people who are trash and people who actually know how to play the game. I could care less if everybody has every single badge on HOF because they had to grind to get that. Now there's people that say, oh, it's gonna be so cheesy, it's gonna be so cheesy. Stay your game up, that's it. We need to have some type of skill gap in 2K for the game to be fun again. That's, that's exactly how I feel about it. Now I feel like there should be a couple new badges added to the game. Now these are just the few ideas that I thought of on the top of my head with the help of some of my friends. So for those of you guys who are watching who helped me with this video, no need to get mad. I'm giving you credit. Now you guys know how we have microwave. Microwave is not necessarily a badge, then it's like one of the DNA things or mental badges, whatever it is. But we have microwave. What if we had freezer now look now some of you started just dying life and y'all are going crazy right now rolling but what if it was a defensive badge so every time that i got on you and i had freezer then you get cold now obviously i don't think it should be like some insta freeze type junk you should probably have a chance to at least play some type of offense but if you start missing a couple shots because my badge is negating your things it makes you get cold a lot faster and also if it was bronze silver hof whatever it would make a difference in how fast you got cold i like that one now this one could be considered a defensive badge too you can call it hustler um grinder whatever the case is hard nose blue collar whatever you want to call it but it's for those players like patrick beverly like udonis haslam like kevin garnett like those people that just are in your face that are diving for the loose balls that are do doing all of the hard nose things in the paint all over the floor but usually in the paint that help your team win i feel like that should also be a badge it should you know distinguish people's player styles i don't know how you'd be able to grind for that badge in my career but that's not for me to know that's for 2k to know so if they take these ideas i don't know come up with something but i think that would also be a lit badge to have too now this last one right here now this one this one's all for lebron and now for those of you guys who actually watch my videos not people who just come through for some reason people think i'm a lebron stan i actually do not like lebron for those of you that don't know um cast fans i'm sorry uh, you don't have to unsub but if you feel like you need to go ahead but anyways um so this lebron badge we don't gotta call it lebron badge i don't, actually don't call it lebron badge please don't do that but i saw lebron playing so many minutes in the fun i thought man was gonna die i thought man was gonna die my man's played 178 minutes a game going crazy but i feel like they should have a badge that you just don't get tired now this would mostly help for pro-am but let's say fourth quarter, um, a minute left, you are down by five, your stamina is all the way down, you call a timeout, 
that junk should just kick all the way back up. Now, I know some of you might say that she's, uh, I don't know if you get an HOF, maybe it should go all the way up, but I feel like that's how LeBron is. My man just gets more energized as the game goes on. Now, in the finals, the wars were too much. That's way too much to handle. That's uh, too much firepower. My man's looked tired for the first time ever in his career, but I don't know. Maybe something like that. Maybe I'm going a little crazy. That was a little bit of a reach, but hey. I, those are my three badge ideas. You guys give me your badge ideas in the comment section. And also, let me know what your favorite one was out of the ones that I said. And if you agree with the badge thing that I said about how they should be able to get badges outside of their player into Hall of Fame. Thank you guys for watching. If you haven't subscribed by now, you're slacking. Make sure you guys go ahead and do that. Let me know what you guys want to see in the comment section. I'll be sure to get that out to you guys. I'm being the comments. I want to communicate with you guys. Let me know some stuff. Talk to me. I'll see you guys later. Peace.